News. Thanks for joining us for 10 Tampa Bay this weekend. I'm Miranda Parnell. Tonight, a tragic story out of Pasco County. Right now, Dade City Police are investigating an incident that left an 11-year-old dead. Police say it happened at Dade City Motocross. They say the boy was riding a dirt bike when another biker hit him. 10 Tampa Bay Shannon Clo is getting the latest from investigators and talking to those who have ridden that same track before. Terry Masco grew up racing at Dade City Motocross. And motocross is an extreme sport. Terry explains the sport is dangerous. Every time he hit the track, he signed a waiver acknowledging that. There is a chance of serious injury and or death. Knowing that we have to sign that every time we go out on the track. Unfortunately, Sunday morning, an 11-year-old boy was killed here. Dade City police say he went off a jump on his bike, crashed as he landed, hurting himself. Police say the boy was able to get up, and as he was getting his bike off the track, another person went off the same jump, coming down on him. The 11-year-old boy suffered upper body injuries in his shoulder area. Immediately, medics who are required to be on the track raced to care for the boy. He was flown out to the hospital, but this afternoon, investigators received the tragic update. The boy died from his injuries. I talked to the owner of this motocross racetrack and he calls this an absolute tragedy. He tells me all of the safety precautions were there. There were medics as required as well as flaggers who are there in case someone falls like this. He says that he is in touch with the family, but right now he's still just trying to digest this tragic news. Terry tells me anytime he's been to the Dade City track, there have been around 12 flaggers at the track who are here for their safety. In terms of what I've been to, it's probably like the safest track. Ultimately, the sport comes with dangers, and Dade City Police will continue to investigate the 11-year-old boy's death. I'm in Dade City. Shannon Clo, 10 Tampa Bay. And the owner of Dade City Motocross told Shannon this incident was the first death in over 45 years.